back at it again with another banger. <laughs> back at it again with the same shit of horror. And Here's a video to start off the Halloween season just Inez right. De la Cruz. A couple of kids are by themselves. I swear to God, actually, now that I think about it, <laughs> yeah, every scary video that I've seen so far where, like, the guy is speaking Spanish, it's mostly from Mexico. <laughs> like, we've never seen a fucking... There's a fucking ghost cutting camera on Colombia or fucking Spain, bro. It's always Mexico. What the fuck? It's inside a house. When they captured this terrifying footage, Ines de la Cruz, who suggested Ines the de la video, Cruz, that sounds writes, like an Mexican, Mexican a couple name, of siblings bro. were alone inside their grandparents' house when something Just extremely creepy was caught on camera accent. by one of them. This is what they caught. Estamos aquí en la casa de yep. mi bisabuela. That's, Se fue yeah, la... yeah, that's, that's a Mexican accent, bro. You know how I can tell it's a Mexican accent? Because there is no accent. <laughs> it's so different the way fucking Colombian people and fucking Spanish people from Spain and people from Venezuela speak. It's so fucking distinctive, bro. Because they probably not she, eh? They do, they do like, I don't know what the fuck they do, but it's just so distinct. Se fue la luz. Eh, esta es la casi porque y mi mamá. Espérense. Don't worry, kid. You're gonna piss yourself when sí. you see this ghost. Mi mamá y mi abuela se fueron al Oxxo a comprar velas por eso, por lo que ah, pasó. They said Oxxo, bro. There's no Oxxo in anywhere but Mexico. That's a fucking joke. I don't know. If, I don't know if Oxxo is Mexican or not, but. Que se fue la luz. Another hint that it might be Mexico over here. Y pues estamos aquí. Estas son las. Mi abuelito. Espérense. No sean chillones. No vamos a, no va a pasar nada. Y esas son las cenizas de mi bisabuelo, porque pues, desgraciadamente él ya falleció. Y, y el baño está allá. El baño, mi hermano quiere hacer pipí, pero el baño está allá. What kind of bathroom? Okay. Y mi abuelo nos dijo que cuidáramos. Oh my God, look at his eyes, look at his eyes. Damn, son. Oh, wait, that's not even the worst of it. The fucking shadow figure. What is, and what is the thing watching them, bro? It's, it's, you better be a straight cat, bro. Mi abuela nos, mi abuelo nos dijo que cuidáramos. They're not even looking at it. Okay, it's gotta be a cat. Pero espérense. Pero pues, el problema yeah, it's es a cat. que aquí it's a cat. no sabemos. Es, y pues, no tengan miedo. No What the fuck are those glowing Abuelito? eyes? ¿Estás aquí? <laughs> Grandpa. Oh, you see that shit? Oh! You see- Oh! Dude, that dude's crazy! It's moving like crazy, that fucking shadow thing! Yeah, that shook him. Yep. Yeah. Ah, I feel so bad for those kids. Someone or something is hiding in moving like appears crazy. to be a shed, Look at that. when suddenly, the thing inside comes flying out and scares the living daylights out of the children. Talk about traumatic childhood experiences. This know, is definitely right? one of them. Now, based on this last scene, it could be that the shadowy apparition is in fact some sort of animal that was taking shelter inside the shed. Mm. What appears to be an apparition Maybe may actually a be a bird or a bat yeah, as yeah, it yeah, seems yeah, to come flying out of the shed. However, this doesn't explain the shadowy figure that was seen early in the video. Yeah, that too. Whatever this is, it doesn't seem to be any kind of bat or bird, let alone an animal. Most viewers think that this may have been a malevolent entity seeking to do harm. As no, with all videos, dead, I leave this one open wild, to interpretation. Bro. He needs to chill the fuck out. What an asshole, caught bro. on camera to be cussing or mayhem after was something after else life. entirely different caught instead. Even the kid was like, Grandpa, you there, Grandpa? Cut the shit out, bitch. The following video shows footage of a barber shop during business hours when suddenly all the barbers inside the shop encounter something beyond belief. Barber T had obtained this recording from the security like camera inside like the shop video. after experiencing this creepy encounter. Here's the footage that was posted by him, along with the text-to-speech voice explaining the video's events. Be sure to look closely for this one, as something else happens that a lot of viewers missed the first time. Take a look. So we just realized the barber shop is haunted. Mm-hmm. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't notice the door moved at first. It. They all noticed it, man. 
pay attention to the door. Paying attention to the door. Oh hell no! Nah. It was yeah, all they're laughing, and they're laughing until, until <gasps> something more happens. It opens up. And <gasps> My boy John was super spooked. Yeah, the so guy in the I. chair, bro. The guy in the chair is like, oh hell no, man. <laughs> the shop is for sale now. If someone is interested, <laughs> doubt. A door all of a sudden opens on its own, and then promptly closes itself seconds later. It continues to do this until stopping about a minute later. The barbers were left spooked, as seen on camera. Now something else happens in this video <laughs> that you might have missed. Uh, At what? the start of the video, we see the door opening for the first time. Yeah. It is around this time though, that a transparent figure passes by the TV. Oh. Whatever this is, viewers believe that it may be responsible for the strange activity. Yeah, no shit, but things bro. were only getting started because what happens next is just downright creepy. More things happen? An hour later, one of the barbers approaches the door Thank when the following shit. happens. Oh, hell no, that's aggravating the What ghost, you're about man. to see is some aggressive paranormal activity. It's gonna slam the door shut, bro. Or sort of I really didn't want to the touch guy. the door handle. Why not? Oh, 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 oh. oh hell no. <laughs> Look at everyone's reaction. <laughs> no, the other guy on the fucking level is still cutting hair, brother. He's still cutting hair. He <laughs> don't give a shit. I pulled up the camera angle from the back room, and everything was thrown everywhere. Like most viewers, Barber T doesn't know what to make of this. Yo. Now, it could... If it were me, I'd use that as clout, bro. It's like, you want to get your hair cut and also experience some paranormal shit? Come on over, bro. Come on over. I feel I feel like people would go, bro. It's like, ah, uh, you get a fresh cut and you get to film fucking ghosts on camera footage. That's two birds and one stone, bro. Two birds with one stone. That'd be lit, dude. I'd fuck it. If, if that shop's still open, bro, I would go. B, that a draft was responsible for the door's movement. There's no fucking but if that way were the case, draft, then the door ass. would follow a somewhat sorry, consistent bro. pattern of if opening you're try and closing. To explain, I mean, this isn't the case here, like, as it opens and closes, sense, as bro. though someone or something draft. is doing this. But, like always, it's up to you to decide as to what this might be. It's ghost. ghost or not. Feel free to let me know what you think. I was kind of surprised that when the guy kicked the door and uh, and it shot back on him, I, I su I'm surprised he didn't like jump or run or anything. He, he was pretty calm. This next video was suggested by Luna Moon, who had found a video that's been keeping her up at night. Luna writes, <laughs> a father takes out his phone and begins to record a playhouse tent that he bought for his daughter. All appears to be normal until the father sees something inside the tent causing him to, to flee, flee out, out of the, the room, room and end the recording immediately. This is what he caught. What kind of thing could be in that tent that could be scary? Oh, hell no. That could be hella As the father though. walks over Jesus. to the side of the tent, he wait. sees what appears. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Look at that. As the father Slow walks motion. over to the side of the tent, I thought he it was cut footage, but no, no, no. sees what appears to be but someone ooh. hiding inside. I but kicked the shit out of that tent. As soon as he pans tent. back to the tent's entrance, the figure is no longer there. Naturally, the father ran out of the room it and ended the recording. Edited, though. Now, this one's hard to explain. Nothing appears to have caused the blanket to rise on its own and appear as though someone were hiding underneath it. The father believes that the playhouse Jesus belonged Christ, to a child is who is now deceased and whose spirit continues to play child? inside. <laughs> Although Luna is a skeptic, she too believes in this notion. But if it weren't for the photo the father had taken the next day, she would not have believed him. Oh, hell yeah. In this photo, something really creepy is captured. Give it to me. The father had taken a picture of the playhouse oh, to show his wife, oh, come on. when out of nowhere, he captures what appears to be a child peering through the room's window. It's your daughter. <laughs> Mind you though, that the father lives on the 15th floor of an apartment complex oh. with no balcony outside of this room. Now that's okay, creepy. That's yeah, yeah, yeah. As always, what are your thoughts on this? 
feel free to share. Let your daughter if you caught something creepy on camera, friend. or if Gary v back to the YouTuber like Yamiku uploaded the following oh, video yeah, after Japanese. hearing strange noises from inside so his home, fucked, it goes without saying, but the following clip is pretty creepy. Yamiku has been capturing footage of poltergeist activity boy, taking place Q. inside his home. From an object being thrown to the ground, to a door closing on its own, what the viewers fuck are certain that, box, that Yamiku bro, has captured picks? footage of something unexplainable. But the most chilling incident has to be one of his recent uploads in which Yamiku captures the following footage. This is what he caught. Also, uh, before I watch the video, I heard that in Japan, if the place is haunted or if there was a murder here, I think it goes without saying that it also happens in every fucking house in the world. But I think in Japan, it's extremely like they lower the prices to an extreme fucking point, bro. Because they believe in ghosts and shit like that. So if, so if they deem a house haunted, they'll lower the fucking prices to like fucking 80% or something. And in Japan, because of the culture, I'm probably speaking out of my ass. I'm, nah, you're not gonna care about this, but uh, fucking culture, they don't give a shit, bro. Like, sometimes fucking rent is fucking expensive, fam, and they'll take a haunted place, bro. <laughs> they'll take it for company, bro. <laughs> Jimmy Q, no, don't open the door, Jimmy Q. Whatever you do, don't open the door. Oh. Oh, the knocks are happening inside. Turn some lights on. Yeah, what's up, bitch? Rush that bitch. <laughs> that dude has some balls, bro. Oh my god, he's got massive balls. The balls on this Asian kid. <laughs> He may not have a dick, but he's got some balls. <laughs> nah, there's nothing on the toilet, bro. Come on. <laughs> Yamaku captures what sounds good? like someone tapping on the bathroom window. No. Yamaku thinks I love that the pipes inside his bathroom walls might have to do something with this. But then one night, in another video, he captures something that seems to suggest otherwise. Again. Yamaku is recording himself oh, lighting Yamaku. an incense candle. When the following Boy, happens, Jabby Q on the same fucking door, huh? It's gonna slam, I bet. And it's gonna be like a loud bang on the door, bro. Oh, hell yeah, bro. So. Rush the bitch. Yeah, turn the lights. Rush. Yeah, massive balls. Big balls. Big guts from big ball drama Q. <laughs> Fuck the incense candles, bro. We're fucking getting to the bottom with this. Viewers believe that he may be dealing with something. Got a tripod also hooked up in the corner. Look at that tripod. <laughs> Viewers believe that he may be dealing with something supernatural. Yeah, no shit. Yamiku has yet to upload more videos on this strange encounter, but for now, it's up to you to decide if this is genuine footage oh, of something paranormal boy, or not. Balls, Whether ghost dude. or not, the video itself is pretty creepy. Deja Jane <laughs> submitted the following photo and writes, In this picture, two children are leaning against a mirror. The mother of the children saw this as a perfect opportunity to take a photo of them, but when she did, she was horrified by what she had caught in the photograph. She had never captured anything like this before. Uh, this, this is, what she is the caught. photo she took. Uh, all right, yeah, similar. Oh, hell no, look at that lady over there. Bro, that's just some fucking shit you got stacked, bro. Come on now. Like, there's this fucking thing in our heads where everything we see, we try to relate, relate it to human. Like, give it a human shape. Like, why the fuck do you think you wake up at the night, look at the pile of clothes, and see, like, the bitch from the ring, huh? Why do you think that is? Because your mind is trying to give it, like, a human shape. 
when it's just a fucking pile of clothes, bro. That may just be you in this in this case. You got some shit stacked. It's not clear if the mother and her two children were the only ones present in the room at which the photo was taken. Nah, maybe. But what even if mean? she stated that she had someone over during this time, expert. it would be hard <laughs> to believe as that someone doesn't appear to be a person. Whatever this is, it's definitely man. creepy. And even without sufficient context, the photo is still nonetheless pretty disturbing. It is. Talk about nightmare fuel. This nah, mate, is nah. the stuff of nightmares. Nah, that's, that's stuff you got fucking laying on the floor, bro. Stack. A family is celebrating a birthday that is. when something disturbing is caught on camera. King Grich submitted the following video and writes, In 2013, the Paris moment. family was celebrating a birthday at their home. Goats. It was Bro, just the five of them as moment. evident in the video. But after looking oh. back at the video, it appears that someone else had been there. Really? Here's the footage that was taken at the party. What's with the blurred text? Whatever. Uh huh. Has it to be? Oh hell no. Oh hell no. Intruder alert. That's spooky. The silhouette of a child passes by in the background. The oh, Paris family was sure child, that bro. no one else was there <laughs> except the five is, of them, black figure. or so they thought. It appears that someone else had made it to the party. Now what's even more strange about the supposed child is the way it passes by. It moves quickly and yeah. appears to be floating above ground as it does so. How, how, the way how it passes do you seems that? very unnatural. <laughs> the Paris family can't seem to explain this. But maybe you can. Like with most videos, this one remains a- <laughs> First of all, how could you do this? It's a fucking girl ghost, a, a child girl ghost. You ever see a fucking middle-aged woman ghost casually floating by the screen? Looks like she's holding a knife. I don't know, it's too dark to see, but definite. It's like the- Mystery. <laughs> I Thanks for watching. Dude, I'm still impressed about the Asian with the big old fucking nutsacks.